This has been too long. I have to say, because uh, I would see this one a fair amount when I was doing my old job. Uh, Heidi from uh, Fielding Winery, good to see you, Heidi. Good to be back. Um, great to have you in here, because this is something we talked about a lot. Graze the yeah. Bench, it's, it, it was an annual thing up until last year, where you didn't do it. You did, um, rock, the we bench. did rock the Bench. Rock the Bench, okay. Um, this is in the Beamsville Bench, which is, if you've never been to the Beamsville Bench, it's just a, it's, it's just, it's just a, a, yeah. a glorious area with award-winning wine. Mm -hmm. um, so we, we're back to graze the bench. Is that by like popular demand? Very popular. Last year we did do rock the bench, which was all in one location. So there were we all at 30 bench, and it was a really really great day. But we heard from the the guests. They're like, please bring back graze the bench. It's okay. such a great event. It's the Saturday and the Sunday. You travel around all the six properties. We've got a hop on hop off shuttle, but it's really such a, ce a celebration of these wineries and these great properties. We have such fun bands like Vinyl Flux is our band and the Postman and Broken Cadence and the food is spectacular. It's, it's a great two days. So it is, is it the first weekend of June? This year it's the 8th and 9th. Okay. So it's the second weekend okay. and tickets are $79. It includes a beautiful glass that you keep with you and then three food and wine vouchers. So you're gonna get actually like a five ounce glass. So it's not a sample. Could you uh, demonstrate how, uh, <laughs> how would you I could, maybe pour I a glass could. of uh, what you might be getting here? Huh? So this the is the, the uh, oh, I know, organized so crime. It's a full, so it's just not a little sampler, okay. No, it's nice because people stay, like people will stay at our place for a couple hours or an hour, um, then they'll travel organized on. And, and a lot of people choose to walk to the wineries, which is really, really nice. How, anybody that's never been to the Beansville Bench, how far away are the wineries? It's really close. We have a block of wineries, probably about a three kilometer minutes. radius, but the Beansville Bench itself as an appellation is eight kilometers long. Okay. But you, so, get, you, get, you can get on, on and off with your ticket? Yes, you can. With your so ticket. So your okay. ticket is Saturday or Sunday. Right. And we actually have a few Saturday tickets still available. Because Saturday's the one that always, well, always, always sold sells out. out. Always sold always. out. Okay. Um, Peninsula Ridge is the place to go. There's yeah. a handful of tickets left. That is what I just, you just, yes, just poured this there. is their beautiful uh, red tail landing Cabernet Syrah. So the wines are gorgeous. Everyone's bringing out their best wines. They really want it to be a celebration of what we do best at the Beamsville Bench. You guys get along so well. I know. How is that? It's great. Well, because <laughs> you guys are in the same business, and everybody's there's only so many people that are coming in, but. Why is it that you guys get so well? well you so have well? to work collaboratively. Like right. no one is going to go to just one winery. Yeah. And there, you know, the the bench wineries, they did so well at the last wine awards, uh, the National Wine Awards of Canada, securing like uh, I think four platinums, which is the top awards. Hidden Bench coming in as the top winery in Canada. No way. Yeah. Okay. So which is amazing. Oh, there they I'm are. Moving, I'm moving it the their, wrong way. There we go. Um, there we go. Gamay Pinot Noir blend. Yeah. But. It all showed really well. The soil composition is amazing. There's such minerality and they're very distinct. So we love coming together as a group and showing off what we can do um, in the Beamsville Bench. How was the winter this year? Because it wasn't cold. We didn't no, really get much okay. of a winter. It was like, yeah. because sometimes when we get into our winter, it becomes too cold and you're worrying about being too cold. We've seen that in the past and kind of ruining some of the vines, but. Uh, we don't want it to get too warm. We don't right. want the huge fluctuations, but Kurt and I were just talking about it yesterday and he said it's Morning, been a Kurt. really. <laughs> Really great winter. Um, we just got to keep steady, keep the the temperatures sort of on on course. But uh, by June, everything will be Every, bright and sunny. And, and it, well, it's such a good time because then you get to, then you get the, the leaves out there. You can go walking through the vineyards yeah. and uh, experience all the different varieties mm -hmm. of uh, varieties of wine. Okay, so let's let's recap. So uh, graze the bench. So it's the June eighth and ninth. Yes. There is so a lot of the tickets are gone for Saturday, but Sunday's a good day too. Sunday right? is actually a lovely day. People yeah. enjoy Sunday so much. It has a different pace. There's still so much fun. There's still dancing. There's still you know uh, yeah. such good times to be had with all the great bands and and food partners but we we just love it we're super pumped about it all the wineries are selling tickets okay. so you have to go to either the wineries online give them a call go to their web page okay. and we cheers to that cheers great seeing you yeah, nice say hi to everybody uh, another show this is a great way to end the show we'll see you tomorrow y'all